We are back with a great start like today this on this Monday. A lot of people, I know you got that music, let's get physical. Uh, a lot of people have gone to physical therapy to rehab a nagging pain or injury. I think this is such a good concept. This morning, we're doing prehab exercises. This is to help you prevent injuries. Jeez. It's one thing to go to PT after you're hurting, but it's another to try to do, do it on the front end. not have to do it all. It's so yes. good. So here to help us is L.A. Tom Augustine, a physical therapist and a trainer. Good morning to you. Good morning. We're Very so happy to have you back. Yeah, I'm so excited to be here. All right, so let's dig in here. I love okay. the concept of prehab. It yeah. makes sense. Yeah, so let's get into the first exercise we'll chat about. So go ahead, okay. sit, on the, sit on the chair. Okay. So the first two are for the neck and shoulder. So we're going to do a resisted chin tuck. So okay. the band's going to go around your head. Oh. You're going to have a little bit of resistance. Okay. And then All you're right. going to pull. I'll kind of show you. You pull your head back into a chin tuck like you're giving yourself a double chin. Hmm. And this is great to strengthen those deep neck muscles oh. that kind of take you out of this forward head position. And also unloads the base of your skull here that can cause some headaches when tight. And you know, sometimes if I sleep funky, you wake up like neck, like Yeah, nine. yeah, this is really great. Did you just say yes? Yeah, I've had it. Yeah, I yeah. had it all weekend. Okay. All right, so next exercise, come on down. We're gonna kneel in front oh, of our chair. Bitten back here, okay. This is called a prayer stretch. You said your shoulder was a little yes. injured, right? So we're gonna have our elbows on top. Oh, I know you can't see me. <laughs> Sorry. So we're going to sink down like this. So this is great. For oh, your yeah. Oh, that feels good. Really? Yeah. Upper back. You know, the upper back is a that. really sticky area. So you really want to stretch down. Oh, wow. Wait, great that's a good move. stretch. How come I've never done this yeah. before? Yeah, this never is a great that. one. All you need is a chair. Oh, that's oh, good. Yeah, right that. here? Especially for your shoulder. Okay, I think your Craig is itching to try yeah. that. I know. It looks good, right? No, I was just going to get your chain off your microphone. Oh, oh, oh. All right, next thing. Okay, so now we're on the mat. Okay, so now we're moving down the body. We're going to do a back and hip. So the first one for the back, we're going to start in child's pose here. So we want to get the back moving. This is going to get good Oh, downward dog. Yeah, that's back. Good. And then we're just going to flow into an upward facing dog or prone press up. Okay. And this is great oh, for getting that back moving. Yeah. Oh yeah. This moves in both directions. How often should you well, do this? It does feel this? good. So these stuff like these ones, you can do every day. Okay. Often. The thing with injury prevention is that you want to do it often. Okay. So, so your muscles get used to it. Okay. Yes. Now we're going to do some. So hips. let's go on to our hips. You're going to have your legs in front of you like this. Okay. Sit up nice and tall. And you're just going to let your knees oh. all side to side. So this oh. is the 90-90 hip I can't even do that. You see? That hurt, like, there we go. Tight you there. can lean back I'm like a little bit more. Extremely tight. Yeah, so getting your hips mobile is really oh, important. You make for it look so back. easy. I'm so not mobile. <laughs> so this one's a great one for you to do. And it as is. you get more mobile, you can come up really tall and go side to side. Oh yeah. So great I need to work on that. For preventing any type of hip issue, arthritis. Which explains why my hip has been hurting, yes. probably. This is perfect for you. Awesome, thank you. And that could lead to your lower back hurting too. Yes. Everything. It all exactly. hurts. Exactly. I what, am I, what am I going to do? All right, we're moving right on down. So now we're going to do, this is for kind of knee, hip, ankle. So the okay. first thing we're going to do, we're going to start on top of the step. One foot on top of the step. We're going to do a three-way step down. All right. Ooh. So with control, you're going to step forward. Step forward. Yep, kind of like you're going down the step, but nice and controlled to the side. To the side. And back. And do I come so back? Oh, exercise. you come back every yeah. time? Yeah, yeah. And so what you is this make good sure, for? So this is good for loading the tendons, the knee, ankle, foot. I'm good for balance, motor control, and imagine like you're using steps all the time, right, throughout your day. So you really want to get strong with kind of going down then the steps. we've got time for one more. Yeah. So the all next right. one is toe walking, heel walking. This one sounds pretty simple. All you have to do is literally walk on your toes. Walk on your toes? So this is loading oh. the Achilles, oh, yeah. the foot, the big toe, any type of plantar fascia like issue. Heels, okay? And then now do it, now do it with your knees bent. So oh, this is same thing. Yep. Oh, yeah. yeah. This is okay. kind of like creep on. Like How long should you do that? Like a dinosaur. I feel yeah. like I look like, ridiculous. So you do. Laps. Or more ridiculous than usual. <laughs> now do your T-Rex arms, right? Yeah, exactly. Okay. That's good for and my knees. Yes, exactly. I think to make it a little bit more fun. All right. That was okay. great. Yeah. Yeah, again, it's that? like doing these before you're hurt, right? Yes. And that yes. way you don't have to get there. I can see yes. how doing this could help. things like this often is, is kind of the important That's thing. That's good. LA Tom Augustine, thank, thank you, you so much. Augustin. <laughs> Augustin, thank you for coming in this morning. Thanks for having me. Scan that QR code or head to today.com slash start today to sign up for our newsletter and join our community. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.